What's up guys, Leopold the Brave here with some more Tekken 7 news. We got a bomb today. Um, I don't even know where to start. Um, uh, let's start with a uh, new content, a new stage. Honmaru from Tekken 4, or Honmaru, Honmeru, Honmaru, however you want to pronounce it, <laughs> from Tekken 4 is making a return as um, a stage in story mode. And I'm certain that if it's a stage in story mode, then it'll also be a stage in um, the rest of the game as well, like all the rest of the other stages we see used in story mode, like the uh, Precipi, however you pronounce it, of Fate, the one, the clip that Hihachi threw Kid Kazuya off of, um, the Middle East, the G Corporation place, you know, all that stuff. All the places we've seen in the story mode so far have been playable stages, and I'm pretty sure Hanmaru won't be any different. And the reason why Hanmaru is playable is because actually in the story mode, you'll get flashbacks of previous stuff in the Tekken series. So it'll be going through the entire lore and we'll get all these important fights. So we may, we may um, be seeing returning stages from other Tekken games as well. Um, one I'd personally... Uh, <clears throat> sorry. <clears throat> <clears throat> what? Ow. One I'd personally love to see is the temple area, like where you fight Ogre. But not the one in Tekken 3, the one in Tekken Tag Tournament. The super cool one with the awesome music that I really like. Um, I really hope we get that stage, or maybe even unknown stage in the first Tekken Tag. Um, so who knows what we'll get as stages further in the future. But we've also got to look at some new game modes. Or the same game modes that we've already seen, but going more in-depth to them. Like the customizations are a lot more advanced. Um, we got to look into the tournament mode for online. And we got to see the gallery, what kind of stuff we can view there. Um, one thing I'm super excited for about the gallery is that you can actually view the um, cinematics for the pachinko machines, which I've used a bit in some of my videos because they're actually really cool cinematics. But the only problem is those are Japan exclusive machines and those aren't anything you can capture easily. They're not a console game. They're not anything on the computer. These pachinko uh, <clears throat> these pachinko machines are just obscure machines in Japan that you're only able to get footage from by recording with a camcorder <laughs> at the thing. Um, there, are, there is a rare occasion where the actual cinematic itself is uploaded instead of just a camera being pointed at it, but it still ends up being low quality. So it's great to know that we'll be able to see these cool cinematics in HD for the entire world to see instead of low resolution Japan only cameras pointed at screens. So I'm really excited for that. Um, there's also going to be a story assist that allows you to pull off the more complex moves during story mode for beginner players. I'm absolutely positive it will not be present in the rest of the game and it'll only be in story mode only. So don't worry uh, to, you, to you experienced players about getting cheated out just because the noobs have easier access to harder abilities. So don't, I, don't, I, I wouldn't worry about that if I were you. So. We just got a lot of stuff. Um, there's also a 12, an 11 and a half minute video by GameSpot showing us uh, the beginning of the story mode um, with an unnamed detective going um, on about the Mishima background and all that kind of stuff. I'd personally choose a different voice actor for the detective. He sounds a bit too deadpan. Like, I understand he's just an average Joe who's just reporting on the family, but I mean, even average people sound more exciting than that. He's like, I'm reporting on the Mishima Zaibatsu. My reporter friend came over to my hotel with some exciting news. You could, you could do it a lot. You could do it a lot better. Trust me. <laughs> so hopefully you'll be able to choose between a Japanese narrator and an English narrator because the English one is not very good. Um, you could, you could do something like this. My reporter friend came over today. He was pretty excited at what he found. He was really pumped up to show me. Whoa! <laughs> Just a little bit more enthusiasm there. Um, but that's the only criticism I've had. I have from what, everything I've seen. Everything looks amazing. There's so much I haven't even covered that you got to see for yourself. But if you want to see that 11-minute story mode preview, then click the link in the description below. I'll have it there. It'll take you to GameSpot's YouTube channel, where the video will be there. Yada yada. Um, Leopold the Brave, Tekken News. It's only over a month, a little bit over a month before the game comes out. I'm super excited. See you next time.